I found this canoe on Facebook Marketplace. Apparently, they were doing bulk pickup in this guy's area, so he gave me a good deal on it. Enjoy the video. I've started prepping the 16-foot uh, canoe. Uh, this white stuff you see all over it, it had fiberglass patches. There's one right here that's that big. It probably had a small crack or something here, and they just did a huge patch on it. But uh, this coating I have, uh, I had an AC guy at my house one time and he was working on the ducks. And this is some stuff that he paints around the ducks to seal them. And it dries, uh, not solid, but it dries pretty pretty hard. And it's a little flexible. So being that it's on the bottom of the kayak, that'll probably help it, I don't know, seal. I don't think this had, had any leaks on it, but I just went over all the little fiberglass patches and wherever it had scratches. And uh, I also did a double coating on the uh, on the, the bow and the stern. I'm not sure which is which because it's upside down right now. <clears throat> I don't think it really matters. But uh, anyway, uh, like I said, I did a double coating on the bow and the stern. I'll probably, uh, once all this dries, do another coating on it. Uh, I might just coat the whole thing. I don't know. But uh, I've got bunch of different paints over there so depending on which can's got more paint in it or better paint in it that will dictate what color it's going to be so keep watching there we go we got the first coat of green paint on it i just happened to go inside and find the perfect color paint i think i have a can of beige somewhere which would actually work pretty good for the inside but, yeah, looks pretty good. It's amazing what a little can of paint will do. Doing a little touch-up work on the canoe. There's a couple of little spots where the <clears throat> fiberglass had like a rough edge on it, so I added a little mastic to it just to smooth out the transition. I went over the whole thing and gave it a, another coat of paint on all the holidays. Holidays are where you paint and then the the surface paint leads through a little bit. See, there was another one here that I don't either. I missed it or I just didn't put enough on it. But yeah, got like three coats. You can see right here the line. I got three coats on the the bow and the stern. There's a little low spot over there, but most longer um, watercraft have stuff like that in them because that's a big long flat piece of fiberglass. And I went through on the inside, did a little work. Don't know if I'll be able to show you this or not. And then over here, there was one patch on the inside up there. So I coated that. And then over here, there's a little, little teeny tiny stress cracks or whatever. And uh, I also coated on the inside of the... Uh, bow and stern coming along all I gotta do is cover the seats and it's ready to go I want to paint that little banding on the outside I'm probably gonna spray paint it black I'm gonna cover the seats with this vinyl it's got it's got plastic on the inside so it's waterproof I cut this piece too narrow but Got the outside painted, got the top and the rail painted, and I'm working on the other side. So this is what the finished product will look like. Excuse the mess on top of my other seat. That's what it looks like. Pretty cool. There's the before and the after.